St. Thomas Dragway. We are doing the first back of the track, no prep, this track has ever seen. So Pro Street 519 is putting on this no prep today. We've got small tire and real street action. And uh, this is the very first backside no prep this track has ever seen. Nobody has ever raced the shutdown at St. Thomas Dragway. So we got the start line at the clocks. We're racing away from the clocks towards the end of the track. And if you know St. Thomas Dragway, you know this is one of the shortest shutdowns. So it is a quarter mile track, but it has one of the shortest shutdowns. So racing towards, <laughs> racing towards the end is going to be a little bit sketchy, but on the same token, it's virgin concrete. It's never been raced on. Nobody has any data out here. So I think it's going to be a pedal fest. The cars are going to go a little slower. They're going to go a little sideways. Um, steel guardrails, a little sketchy. This is going to be a really sketchy race today. And uh, not to mention, if they poured this concrete this year, or this asphalt. So it's, it's new, newish, uh, most of it. It's not very flat. Here, let me show you. It's got a little bit of a, a rib in the middle here. Um, so this is a little bit sketch. It's not too bad. It's not like a huge bump, but it's not perfect by any means which is going to make for a very interesting no prep, very interesting. So let's go take a look at the start. All right, guys, check out the start line. So we got a similar setup to uh, TMP, if you're familiar with OSO. We got Alex's uh, cam jump cam area here. And this is the start line right here. Start line has zero passes ever, virgin concrete, nothing out here at all. Nothing out here. There's nothing. Very first, no prep. So, some of you, okay, I can hear you guys in the comments right now. You're probably asking, why don't you race towards the tree? There's a lot more shutdown. Well, for insurance reasons, apparently it's in the insurance clause. They're not allowed to race towards the tree. They have to race towards uh, the shutdown. Apparently, this is, this is a contract. Can't mess with it. That's the way it is. So, this is the way it is. And uh, it's going to be. I think it's going to be a pedal fest, guys. So I may look a little bit tired today. I was in uh, Milan Dragway last night filming the PYOP. That was a wild video. Make sure you check that one because that's already on the channel. And uh, check out my other PYOP videos as well. And uh, today's going to be crazy, guys. So uh, enjoy the video and uh, let's see how it goes. All right, Mo, what's up? What's going on, man? How you doing? Pretty good, man. Welcome back to Canada. Appreciate good to see it, man. you. Thanks for having us, man. Thank you, you. Yeah, man. You got the Fox body back out. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We come out here and uh, check out the track, the surface, and it is bare. There is, like, not even a single burnout mark out there. So this is where this car usually works. It's, like, the bare... Yeah. You know... We were, we were talking last night at, uh, at Milan, PYOP, and uh, we were talking about, you know, virgin surface, virgin concrete, uh, you know, it's the very next day. You guys got quite the hike to get up here. But, oh, yeah. Uh, you racing uh, last night and then the, back today, but... We barely got much sleep, but... Yeah, when, you do, when you're doing what you love, I mean, sleep will come later. Just, That's you know, right. go out there, have fun. Exactly. But hopefully, uh, it turns out pretty good today. You know, this is the surface we got the car set up for, so... So tell me, tell me about that, because, like, last night, we are at Milan. You know, it's a little bit quick. Maybe not as quick as TMP, but it's a pretty quick track. Now you got completely zero data on this virgin concrete. What do you do to the car to get it ready? So what we're gonna do is basically uh, just turn her, turn her down, turn her way down, but yeah. just have just enough, maybe even on a scramble. So Oof. if it is taking it, I got the scramble button for uh, an extra security. Uh -huh. um, but realistically, first pair, you know, when you first, first, or first round, you kinda gotta guess the tune up. Yep. And if that tune up works, you just gotta work from that. If it doesn't work, you just hope you pray that the guy that you're racing either blows his tire off or you just somehow yeah. can't get in front of him. So I have a feeling it's gonna be a pedal fest today. 100%. I um, definitely can see the at least the first few rounds. Yeah. Know, people blow the tires off. How's your brakes? The brakes that <laughs> I heard the shutdowns. There's no shutdown. It's, it's a little bit small. Well, I kind of took off the uh, parachute for uh, for weights. So oh, you got the weight on there. Me pulling the parachute ain't gonna do nothing. Uh, Hopefully, you know, we get, we're not, I don't think we're going to go that fast. So I think we should, I you know, we should be able to yeah. break in time. Handle it. 
All right, well, welcome back to Canada again. Yeah, hey, uh, is, is this first time this season? Uh, yeah, Canada this year, yeah. All right, so yeah. welcome back to Canada again for uh, another season of no prep, and good luck to you, brother. I'm, it, I'm pushing for you. Thank you. All right, cheers. All right, guys. First off, welcome to the first ever back of the track no prep here at Sparta. So we really got to thank our friends at St. Thomas Dragway here. Without them, we wouldn't have been able to do it. So All thank right. you, guys. Woo! Okay, so most of you guys have raced with us before. You guys know how this stuff goes. So if you jump, you lose. You cross, you lose. Water burnout only. You only get one burnout. Now that burnout, it has to have smoke, right? If you don't if have there's smoke, smoke, it's a burnout. Exactly. One okay. burnout only. If there's tire smoke, it's a burnout. And then obviously we don't have a Christmas tree back here, guys. It's going to be flashlight start. Alex on the light. I think all of you guys have raced with them. Now disputes. If you guys have a dispute, it's going to cost $100 for the dispute. But if you're right, you keep the money. Yeah, this this line, just stops a whole bunch of BS. Finish of, line, tire crack. Exactly. So, And then as far as the buy run, you can only get the buy run one time. You do not have to take it if you don't want to take it. And then just one more thing here, usually after each round we would get you guys to come back and draw chips. It's been the biggest pain in the ass to try to track down like 40 racers, so we're going to let you guys draw chips for the first round. After the first round, we're going to draw the chips, we're going to put them on the big whiteboard back there so you guys can just come up, see who you're racing, get ready and then come back up. I now, run one tire crack camera for jumps. You guys that race with us know if one of your crew blocks the camera and someone disputes you, you're automatically out because we can't determine if you left early or not. It's a pretty common rule everywhere. I wrote, there's a big triangle there, it says no step, there's arrows. You guys that are with us all the time know this. Uh, the starting line is an orange line, it's one line. Put your bumper at the line. Turbo guys, stage a little shallow. If you're a guy that bumps, have your crew let me know that you're gonna bump. Same as it always is, I'm going to hold my light up above my head here, whatever. I'm going to point at you. I'll give you guys time up to five seconds each car. Uh, turbo guys that bump, you get one bump. I don't care. If I do this and I count to five and I stop and I go to the other guy and you bump after the fact, you still get that bump. You get one bump only. Any questions about that? All right, guys. Here's the light. It's easy to see. Check out this. They got like a mud bogging course out here. Like right where the shutdown is, where the turnoff is. You miss. You guys are having a great time out here. St. Thomas Dragway, not just for drag racing guys. Got all kinds of ATV mud bogging. I saw some monster trucks in here. They got stands over there, bleachers, like these guys know how to party. Right next to the drag strip, man. It's gonna be a good show. Alright here we go. Round one of small tire. Coming up right now, we got first round flybacks for all classes. Right now it's his first round. At the first ever back of the track. No prep at St. Thomas Dragway. Finally got it out, eh? Yeah. Good to see you, man. Just to get some data, that's it. Get some data, all right, buddy. Well, it's good to see the truck out for the first time in your hands, eh? Thank you, buddy. All right, good luck. Awesome. Turbo LS. Well, you said you like virgin concrete. Your first pair down, buddy. That shit happens all the time, bro. As virgin as it gets. Happens I... all the time. Good luck. Have a safe pass. All right, here we go. Round one, small tire. First round buybacks are available. This is your first round, small tire. Pro Street 519, no prep at St. Thomas Dragway, back to the track. First time ever. There's Trevor. 20 on uh, oh. oh, yeah, you like both? <laughs> we all like both. Take the very first win ever at the St. 
Ronnie Thomas backtrack. All right, next up we got Ron Charlton in that six liter turbo LS powered Fox body. He's gonna go against Quad that twin turbo Mustang. Taking that in the right lane. Next up, Sinister Performance Club. We got Mike Curley, Sinister Performance Club on YouTube. He's running a shop truck, a twin turbo LS powered S10. Taking the wind, moving on to the next round, small tire. It's up here in Tangerine Dream, that LS powered Fox Fox. It's gonna go up against this blue turbo Fox. LS powered. back in. <laughs> he saved it. He saved it. All right, we got the Barnes Race Team up here from the USA. Running small tire. It's Regal. Uh, we got another LS Turbo. LS Turbo, I believe this guy's on nitrous. second round a small tire I knew it was close because Johnny was driving that thing uh -huh. I knew it was close he was driving it. <laughs> all right hey I remember this Nova it's been, uh, it's been a couple of years since I've seen this guy he wasn't out last year got an LS big turbo look at the size of that snail right there he's gonna go against Rick Myers who actually has a Ford engine, this is a turbo, turbo salt, it's a Ford power, I'm not sure what it is. It is a new setup, so we still dial it in, but 
car is fast. It's Fairmont. Rick Myers had a pitch there on Stereo. Myers Auto Body. Myers Automotive. This guy is actually my mechanic. He's actually my, I think my car to him. He thinks he's my Mustang. I am not a mechanic. I am an electrician and a videographer. This guy's a mechanic. He, he's a really nice guy. Both of these guys are nice guys, actually. I've talked to both of them. I think the left lane is going to come around before the right lane, guys. <laughs> yeah, all the burnouts in the left lane so far have been on point. Yeah. Right lane, it's been a lot of people getting wheel speed and just losing it, just driving yeah. away. Automotive Kitchener, Ontario. That's my mechanic, guys. He fixed my Mustang on Thursday. <laughs> Mo, you're already back up here. Uh huh. <laughs> How was that? It was. Uh, it was pretty decent for the first uh, for the first hit over on the surface. Look at this lane, dude. That's like it's all you. <laughs> you gotta set that bar up high when you go. Uh, yeah, hopefully she does that. You know, she she gets faster and faster throughout the rounds, and uh, hopefully we can take it home. So this is this is your this is your jam here, right? This like you love jam. this. I love this. Like you'd race on dirt if you could, eh? I race on gravel, rocks, sand, dude. All that good shit. Snow. I'll make it into the rain, dude. Yeah. I, if, if it helps, you know, I figure it out. You know, that way we're ever, forever in that worst case scenario. Golden. All right, brother. Good luck, second round. Appreciate it, man. Thank you. Yeah, how, how, how big is that turbo? This one? Yeah. 94 mil. 94 mil turbo. Woo! All right, buddy. 2JZ, obviously, yeah? Is it billet? Billet block. Billet block 2JZ, 94 mil. All right, brother.
Gray Lane taking the win. Magic, Twin Turbo, LS Power, GMC. He always drives it. <laughs> he drove it, yeah. He, he always it. drives it. <laughs> All right, next up for Real Street. A lot of these cars are unknown to you guys. Some of these cars are local, so I'm not sure what's in this Ford pickup. That's interesting. So we got the pink deuce in the right lane. That's your bell. Tetanus 1948 right there on YouTube. You have to subscribe. This guy's out here at uh, St. Thomas Dragway pretty much every day. So Love the stuff. Go check out the mud bog videos from our fun park uh, next door to the track. Awesome, awesome things out there. Full size ATVs, yeah. downy holes, hand drags. Exactly. Ben's the best though. Remember, videos. Remember the footage I showed you guys earlier? Well, if you want to see videos of that, go to his channel, Tetanus 1948 on YouTube. Thanks guys. Love you all. All right, we're still in first round, real street. Thomas, it always seems to work for fairly good for us. Yeah. So we're here. We went 
personal best last night, and uh, and we made it through first round today. So we're doing really good. All right. I'm remind me. Uh, remind me of the setup of the motor. Uh, it's a 351 Windsor. Uh, it's got a S480 turbo on it. Uh, C4 automatic. All Ford. All yep. Ford still. All Ford. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Nice. So yeah. All right, buddy. Well, good luck in uh, second round, and I'll pull for you. All right. Awesome. Thank you. All right. Good job. See ya. Making the trip up. So, uh, were you, you were in that Milan last night, were you? Yeah, it was one of our other cars, street car. Oh, you were in the other car? Oh, uh, with the daily driver? Yeah, yeah, we did the daily driver. Oh, okay, so what made you uh, bring this up today? Yeah, I heard about it. Friend of our mode, trying to get us to come up with it. be a good time, but back in the day. Yeah? That's cool. We might have a chance for this one. Well, you're experiencing a first for us here. We've never run backside on this track ever before, so. Nobody has any kind of data here. It's it's yeah. all brand new. So, uh, what did you bring out today? Oh, it's our uh, '78 Buick uh, Regal, nitrous car, street car too. But yeah, well, we're all street cars here, right? Right. <laughs> yeah. We had it for like 25 years. And oh yeah. It's kind of evolved over the years into this. And just having fun. Nice. Yeah. Well, it's good to see you up here with your family, and uh, good luck in second round, eh? All right, thanks. All right, cheers. Yep. All right, second round, small tire. Tangerine Dream here in the left lane with that LS-powered Turbo Fox body. Going up against that blue Turbo Fox. Let's see if he's got enough for Justin. but another save. Left lane's gonna take the win, Tangerine Dream, but that blue fox body got squirrely again. Saved it again. Oh man. All right, so job truck's broken. We just got word he's actually broken, so it's gonna be a competition by the Barnes team. a hot in that 94 millimeter billet block 2JZ Toyota Supra right hand drive
Ford Fox body again. It's going to go up against Rick Myers and that Ford Fairmont. close but he didn't cross not till way down there not till after the fence hell yeah hell yeah brother rick myers out here going rounds with his family dude this is a family day right here dude i tell you man uh, i had a uh my buddies convinced me to get some duct tape out and fix a torn boot so we can go on to second round and it worked, I don't believe it. The duct tape and zip, zip ties held 18 pounds. We tore another hole, yeah. and we're about to duct tape it again, and I got my fingers crossed for the buy. So one of your couplings has, has got a hole in it. Yep, the one that goes to the throttle body. It's got a tear in it like this. What? We, and you're duct taping that? Duct tape, zip ties, and a beer can. No joke. No. <laughs> just It just took second round. Nice, brother. Hey, I'm well, so well, excited, it's ridiculous. Whatever works, buddy, keep yep. going. Oh yeah. Keep going. Oh yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's check this out. No joke. No joke right there, eh? <laughs> no joke. Yeah, Fox <laughs> game, no no tape, joke. Zip ties. These guys are going rounds with this homemade setup. Hey, you gotta do what you gotta do. You gotta <laughs> go to the finals, baby. Yeah. It's all good. You gotta do what you gotta do, eh? All right. These guys out here making it work one way or another. We're going. We're going. We're going for it. Oh, man. Super excited. <laughs> Alright buddy. Everybody's pulling for you man. We'd love to see this car win. I hope so. We're gonna try. <laughs> Alright. We're gonna try. Okay man. Good luck next round. Awesome. Alright, third round of small tire. We got Rick Myers coming up in that Fairmont. That turbo uh, Windsor base Ford Power Fairmont. He is going up against Wajdi. <laughs> Well, she's got the left lane too. Twin turbo, small block Ford. It's a Ford on Ford, uh, all Ford race. Had to let off. That was a good race, though. They had a good start. Not bad. Mad respect to uh, think, Ricky I for think, coming out. I think Waji's on track to maybe win it today. Waji's looking strong, too. Absolutely. But uh, we got a main event race right here. We got Tangerine Dream with that LS powered big turbo box body. He's going to go up against Mo. LS Turbo Fox on LS Turbo Fox.
Check and tape. Yeah! Right lane, Justin taking the win. Wow, by a foot. Justin by a foot. That's a hell of a race right there. All right, next up we got Mark. That Grammy, LS powered turbo Fox body. Going up against Mars from Michigan. That nice Regal. Tell me a little bit about the lanes here. I mean, it's not virgin concrete anymore. What's, oh, I got no on? fucking clue. I think the left lane's better. The left lane like is the definitely right lane better. has a dip in it. Uh huh. And you know, the left lane a lot earlier in the day, guys were just doing better burnouts in the left, so it's putting more rubber down. Do you think that dip is really affecting the right lane? It looks like it no, might be. No, because the guys have gone fast in the right lane and won. Oh, like true. Justin just beat Mo. That's true. In the right lane. That's true. But that was a that was a barn burner. That was right to the end. So I mean, by a bumper, by a bumper, right? All right, here we got the hard tire final. We got Mike G and tetanus shot. That Turbo LS G body going up this going up against this GTX. No stranger to the hard tire final is he. This is gonna be a good race here. These guys are back and forth all day long. Three cars, oh wow. All right, semifinals for small tire. We got Mark, we got Matt Granby, LS powered, turbo Fox body. He's gonna go up against Blodgy and that twin turbo small block Ford. Driving two cars today. Hey, hey, this breeze is nice because it's blowing it out. It is nice. take his fly run right here. Man, that car's fast. Holy crap. Here we go. We got a real street final here. Full of salt. That 632 big block is going to go up against Matt Searle. That 351 big turbo box body.
class winner today. Grass the mat on another W. All right, Justin getting ready for the small tire final. He's gonna go up against Matt Granby. Both are LS powered Turbo Fox bodies. Justin get the W today after a tough loss, a very close race against uh, Tommy and the Falcon last night at PYOB in Milan Dragway. He's back here the very next day going to the finals in small tire. All right, Alex, we got one race left, small tire final. It's going to be Matt Granby and Justin. Who do you got? So. I don't think it's a place where lane choice is going to really affect it. Mm -hmm. um, they both just made passes in the left. Just by eye, I think Justin made a faster pass. You it know, looked quick, yeah. Car left, good. Hovered the, yeah, yeah. That's hilarious. You could never have this interview when this car's racing, except for that one. <laughs> car left, real strong. Hovered yeah. the front tires about this high for 150 feet. Yep. He was looking good last night too. Great to be. Yeah. Um, last night he was on a mission. Mm. So uh, yeah, I, th I think I think Justin's got it. Okay. But right. you know, I don't think lane choice will be a factor. But I think if Justin's left lane, he's, he's for sure got it. But we'll see. They're so, both they're both really similar. I'm assuming. I think they're both ladder bar cars. Okay. So you know. Big single turbo LS can't be that different. How much of a difference do you think it's going to be? Like, what's the gap? Oh fuck, I don't know. There might not be a gap. Might, might be door to door. Car. Yeah. All right, we'll find out. What uh, What do you think of the service here after uh, a successful day of no prep? Uh, you know what? I don't. I do not think the surface here is going to get any better. Like okay. other tracks come around and get faster and faster and faster and faster and faster. Mm -hmm. I think today will, for the most, well, sorry, this place for the most part will stay probably on par with what it was today. The weather was nice, sun was out, it wasn't crazy hot, so, True. you know, it's optimal conditions and so, okay. I think it's going to stay about where it's at. Alright. Alright guys, we've got a small tire final coming up right now. Alright, this is your small tire final. This is for the pot. We got Tangerine Dream in the left lane, Justin, uh, Matt Grampy in the right lane, a couple of Turbo LS Fox bodies. He's gonna get it, let's see. Taking the win at the very first backtrack, no prep at St. Thomas Dragway. Hey, our tire winner. Finally. What's yeah, that? One of one. And you win a sword. Oh, I get a sword. <laughs> oh, man. that's I can't wait to play fucking Kung Fu in the garage. <laughs> <laughs> nice. How's the car running, man? Uh, they ran, that last pass was way better than everything at Milan last night by a lot. I mean, it's still off what we were running on the street a couple days ago, 
But we're getting on it, man. We got a little, we the, the TPS was fucked up yesterday. Oh, really? Yeah, so the TPS was reading backwards. So at wide open, it was 11%. It wasn't acting in the boost controller. So oh. it was just doing whatever the fuck. So. Uh, that sucks. Yeah, yeah. Jack's fucking tough, man. Yeah? Uh, he whipped my ass that second round. I was like, I was like doom and gloom. I'm like, ah, uh, he's got me. He's got my number all year. He fucked me up in Toronto. Yeah, yeah. Um, all right, brother, congratulations. Thanks, buddy. Our entire winner today. We'll see you uh, a couple weeks, right, Tom? Like, end of June, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah I got Canada Heads up next and Grand Bend. Yeah, so we're good. So I get to uh, fucking put about 75 hits after this test them out. So. Nice. Thanks, buddy. I appreciate All it. All right, see you in Grand Bend, buddy. See you in Grand Bend. All right, guys, that'll do it for today's first ever Backtrack No Prep at St. Thomas Dragway. As you can see, As you can see, it's a pretty stellar setup back here, so I'm excited for the next one. But well, that's it for now. Thanks for watching, and I'll freaking see you later. <laughs> Do it for Dale. All right, cheers, guys. See you in the next one.